as the title, you can already guess what <laughs> this video is going to be about. And I, I wish I could say I was clickbaiting because, to be honest, I've never clickbaited in my life. There's always like a hint of sarcasm, so you know that it's like, it's something different. But here I am. And no, it's not clickbait, it's true. After four days, I got fired. I mean, is it is it is it me getting fired or are they letting me go? I, I don't know. It's, it's one or the other. No, I was working. <laughs> at this place because i'm not working there anymore and it's in green valley like town like two two towns away i think it's called mountain view cafe and it's this tiny little quaint base place i wasn't expecting anything and to be honest i put in for so many locations and i was just like i'll just go to the first one that hires me and they hired me first and we're like okay we need you blah 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 these days one of my sandwich makers is leaving so eventually we're gonna train you on that side i on the first day you know learning second day i was still learning i would say still slow of course and on the third day is when i got pulled aside but before that let, let me tell you how i did on the third day on the third day i kind of would get confused i would like maybe grab a different sandwich uh bun grab the wrong cheese the, the havarti havarti cheese or something and be like be like no it's swiss and stuff like that the other thing about this like small place is they have specials and i don't know why they they made it as if i was supposed to know th i've never eaten there <laughs> and they made it as if, as if i was supposed to know the special and I was like, like one day they had meatloaf, they had a pot pie, and I was like, okay, that's easy. Like today, for example, they had a fish sandwich, and I was like, okay, I know how to do that. Besides that, I get pulled aside after work, and she's like, so Paris... JR is telling me and he's like and he says that you aren't really improving that much and etc and that you aren't like learning and it's like this isn't even fast like during like winter that's when we get really fast and like we'll have a full stack of people you're gonna need to be going fast and stuff and he was she was like so what, what are you thinking like are you gonna be able to do that and I'm like I and I said I honestly I don't know it's too soon to say there's a chance that I can go fast there's a chance that I might not go fast I honestly could to not tell you and then he, then she's like well you you have to consider jr has been here for seven years and stuff so he's gonna or like six years he's gonna know and be a lot faster than than you and i'm like yeah and she's like okay how about this we'll see where you are in two days and then i'll call you back in and see you know after that it's today and i'm like okay it's, i'm getting close to being fired I, you know i'm telling my mom telling my stepdad i'm like yeah they told me i need to go faster or else you know i want to consider something else and they're like okay listen just take one day at a time and get better every single day and the other thing i was like i said i don't know if i fully mentioned it there's a hot and cold so kind of like a uh, red robin but like it's actually cold one the girl there older they're both older 70 and 60 the girl does um cold sandwiches and salads and then the place i was learning was hot side but to be honest she was still kind of teaching me and stuff like that and she was like i need you fully trained by november and i was like I'll, I'll try my hardest and stuff like that and they're nice people the waitresses are <laughs> there was this one waitress named Haley. she'll never see this but Haley was she, she was fine she was it's funny also like she wasn't working the past few days and i was just forgetting everything getting getting clustered i'll say that then today she's there and i'm working better and i'm also and she asked me such a simple statement but i was like ooh, okay and she's like do you like cookies and i was like yeah i like cookies <laughs> I didn't say that like that, but I was like, yeah, I like, I like cookies. That isn't the point. I got fired. Yeah, I, 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 I'm I, just gone. <laughs> she like, at the end, I was like, because I didn't know when I was working. Like, so I was like, so do you want me to come back Monday or tomorrow? Or and she's like, well, Paris, pull JR aside. And he was saying like this morning you weren't doing anything and that you haven't improved at all. And to be honest, it and, and then, then she said like in that you wouldn't like, we we just don't think you'll be able to do it like fast enough ever. And that was like, I was like, yeah, that, that makes sense. Like I was thinking in my head, I was like, yeah, that makes sense. I, I probably won't ever be like that fast. But at the same exact time, it hurt. And this is what Red Robin and what, why do bosses have that word? It, it's such a, I don't mind getting fired. I don't mind if you say, we don't think you have the capabilities to handle this job. But for you to say that you haven't improved is a statement that can make you cry. I didn't cry, but it was my pride like, oh my god, oh my god, I need water. That's the other thing, I don't drink when I'm at work. I'm just dehydrated, hungry, and Haley's a ginger. <laughs> I, that's the important thing. But yeah, she, she was like, yeah, yeah, and... She's like, I'm sorry, I really wish you it could work. And I was like, yeah, it's, it's fine. And I'm like, thank goodness I have Domino's. But Jesus Christ, it's, it's just interesting how... Because because the thing is, the same thing with Red Robin, right? I could improve, but it just takes longer. Like, should I... 
I mention my disability, it takes a lot longer for me to learn. But the thing is, is it is that a lot of time four days or is that not a lot of time? I don't understand. Like, to be honest, I was doing pretty good. Like, I was able to make sandwiches and do fries and stuff. So let me also say on the third day when she pulled me aside, she said, you tend to forget when the fries are in. So I was like, OK, I need to remember that fries are in and like always remember to pull them out and stuff. And that's what I that's what I was working on. I was working on that and getting the bread right. Right. Because like my mom said, like, try to improve a tiny bit every single day. So that that's what I was trying to do. I was trying to improve and at least get those out of the park. And I was like, let's put off holding, like learning cold sandwiches and salads. Let's just try to learn this. Right. Didn't work. It didn't work because I, I still got fired. But the th it just it just I'm, I'm, I'm not saying that I didn't mess up and that like it's probably true that I wouldn't be able to do it. But like. Ugh. Renee, she'd be like, okay, Paris, like in the morning, and I'd be kind of waiting for them to give me directions and stuff. Cause like JR and what the, the boss mentioned, I don't even remember the boss's name, Jesus, mentioned to me was that I don't, I wasn't doing anything in the morning. And what I'm, what I don't understand is what would you want me to do in the morning? Because I, you didn't like the only person, now that I think of it, the only person who taught me what to do in the morning is, um, Roche, Renelle, I really, the older lady. Oh, dude, I'm dying here talking. That, that's how dehydrated I am. The more I think of it, the more sad I get. At, at first, I was indifferent, but now I'm just sad. Not because I got for someone to say you haven't improved at all is just such a kick in the nuts. That That's what it feels like. And it's the fact that I improved. Like, for example, they're like, okay, white cheese, then yellow cheese. And then on the other side, vice versa. So one doesn't overwhelm. I'm doing that. Toasting both sides. I'm steaming it. I literally, for the first time, made like a few sandwiches at once. And then for me to get fired and then them just say yeah you haven't improved at all is just it's a slap in the face that that's what it feels like it just ugh, it angers me like it it i don't want to blame them right because the waitresses are nice the lovely cold sandwich lady is nice but why in the morning i can't do something if i don't know how to do it like let, let's say like at red robin that's the first thing they teach you hey so we're going to be teaching you how to how how is it possible <laughs> Oh, oh god, it's it's a scam. Is like work life a scam? You you feel like when when you're black, <laughs> not just black. When you're you feel like okay, let's say you're white and you're in a black owned restaurant, or you're or you're black and you're in a very predominantly white people. Like I didn't see one person of color come in to be honest. That's what it, and you feel like they aren't judging you, but they're judging you. That makes them kind of have their way with you. That's what it felt like. Like for the like now that I'm thinking of it, I don't understand how they said I didn't improve because like how how didn't i improve i like rochelle still don't know if that's the right name she told me i'd make the potato the egg salad i'm chopping the eggs i get done she's like okay then we add some pepper and you add mayo and I'm, I'm mixing that up i carry that okay we put these boxes away how am i supposed to do th those are all separate things that get done on separate days when we need it right how am i supposed to come in the next day and be like okay we need to make egg salad oh i need to get sauces like you need to tell me what you want me to do hey Paris. okay in the morning i want you to put on egg salad or in the morning or, or when this sauce gets halfway there's gonna be a, a container in the fridge could you go refill it every time that gets halfway they, they, they never told me that so what am I supposed to do in my meantime I'm not even on my phone I'm just sitting and waiting literally for anything to happen and I get a ticket and I'm like damn and I'm I'm I'm, I'm fine with admitting when I can't do something I'm fine with admitting that oh yeah I'm, I'm the weakest link probably but but for them to say I didn't improve at all is just crazy that's crazy. I literally, there's a burger. There's a burger. I'm, my parents are vegan. I haven't made a burger in so long. And I put the burger on and I'm, I'm doing, and I'm learning, right? And I'm, I'm, I'm like, you know, what he does is he t touches the middle, sees if it's tender, if it's soft. And I do it, right? I take it off and he's like, wait a sec, let me check. And he checks and he's like, oh yeah, it's good. Put it on the bun. And I do that, right? Did it with the next burger. Fine. I'm improving. Like yesterday, I couldn't even do that. He had to keep checking and be like, eh, a little bit more time. Eh, a little bit more time today i could do i did two burgers without any problems i did a four cheese sandwich without any problems i did all these things without any problems and then they say i didn't improve it just it just sucks it just sucks like good luck because i uh yesterday also when she called me she was like some one of the waitresses came in and was like hey someone called and see if you guys are hiring and she was like yeah just put an application online or in, in person and i was thinking to myself because I, I to be honest i already knew i was gonna get fired probably but i was like i'll i'm gonna i'm gonna give it my best shot and i'm gonna improve like my mom said improve every single day apparently i didn't improve fast enough by day four i mean i i i learned the menu for nothing literally i, I could tell you every single sandwich right now four cheese well i mean for four cheese sandwich 
I, I don't know the exact names, okay? Havarti, cheddar, American, and Swiss toasted on a Texas toast. Then you have the dip. This goes on a Havarti. I, I don't know exactly how to say it. A, a car, a car, it's, it goes on like a, a certain type of bun. Okay, you toast that, then bam, you get this. I don't know what the hell it's called, rib, ribeye, ribeye, slice, you get that, you put that on the sandwich, then that's done, you can add stuff for $1.50, uh, Southwest, Western, sourdough, toasted on one side, a thousand island, with pepper, jalapeno, roasted, with turkey, and pepper jack, and bacon, turkey, pepper jack, jake, bacon, to be, to put it in the exact order, from bottom up, it's turkey, bacon, pepper, cheese, and all those stuff, I didn't know yesterday and I, I mean I knew it right but I was getting flustered and today today I know I'm getting the stuff I'm doing it fast I'm doing it at, le at least as fast as I can right and at least I know the sandwiches but it just it just wasn't enough and that, that what annoys me there's there's more sandwiches by the way there's oh there's like a BLT that's on like wheat it's like toasted on both sides with no butter and just bacon and it just it just annoys me that like I just it, it just I wasn't good enough but also they, they she said I didn't improve no apparently JR said I haven't improved at all I, I don't know if he said that and she was exaggerating or if they just wanted me out of there or what but it, it, it was like I was back at Red Robin and they were like you haven't improved at all which is which is oh my god I just I just I just thought about it more. The same time I got yelled at at Red Robin, I was going fast and it was someone else's mess up, right? And it was me going to get plates and the bun not being made because I was getting the plates, right? And then they said, oh yeah, you completely messed up whatever, right? And that I haven't improved at all. I, I haven't improved at all. And then here I am. And and that day was going good. That, that, that was the best I've ever done. And how is it possible when I'm at my best, when I'm doing the sandwiches? Oh, dude, I'm about to lose my shit. I'm doing the sandwiches. I'm, I'm doing, oh. JR says, you haven't done anything in the morning. What am I supposed to do? What, what, like, what am I supposed to do, actually? Like, like, do you want me to refill the sauces? How do I do that? Do you want me to make the sauces? How do I do that? Do you want me to do the eggs? Yeah, I could do the eggs. You just taught me how to do the eggs. I'll go do the eggs. Where do I, where's the thingy real fast? Just because you guys never showed me. I can do stuff, but you need to, how? Oh, like I don't under oh, oh, oh the thing also is they made it as if I had time like they said you need to learn fast and but they said because she's leaving in November so you need to learn my side and I was like oh dude that's more than enough time I already I, literally what I was thinking to myself was I already know all the sandwiches all the hot sandwiches by day four that, that's literally my mindset I was like okay I'm doing good me and then I come in and it, I wasn't doing good enough I mean I'm, I'm right now I'm just sad I went from indifferent to angry I'm sad and angry does that make sense like uh, Haley <clears throat> if you ever see this oh god my allergies dude well, actually let me let me let me let me forget all that I mean yes of course Haley there was I'm not gonna lie that place is disgusting disgusting uh not in terms it's not disgusting but it was gross like it's kind of like like i said it's a like oh small business which i'm surprised it got so busy but it's a small business but i was surprised with how gross it was like so they had this mat on the floor and it was like it had holes in it and it made you grip nicely like it made you you, you, you could have worn like regular shoes and it, it at least gripped nicely but there was like I literally saw cockroach, a dead cockroach in there, bacon, all these different foods, of course, from who knows when the, when the last time it was cleaned. I don't know if they clean it weekly or what. And it was just gross. And then, oh my god, <laughs> mucus. I feel like being near all those elderly people got me sick, bro. I, I swear to god, I literally was working. I was like, holy crap, am I getting sick from being... Okay, I can't like I was saying, it was really gross. There was, I think it was the third day actually, there was a cockroach and it was big. It was a big cockroach and it was like just crawling on the mat. And I was like, damn, that thing is ginormous. I was like, okay, I need to kill it. And I went to go get like a dirty rag and she was like, what do you use that dirty rag for? And I was like, oh, there's a bug, there's a cockroach. And she's like, oh yeah, we get them every once in a while. And she's like, just use a paper towel. Kitchens have cockroaches, right? But like, honestly, how often do they get cockroaches? Because not only was that like, like the thing is, if you get a small cockroach, that's different from getting a 
big cockroach, like a full-size cockroach. If you get a full-size cockroach, that probably means you ain't cleaning correctly and that there's food there. Like big cockroaches like that don't just come out because of like food. Those things come out if there's a bunch of food. And then their stove top was very gr grubby. I literally was like cleaning and I was like, Jesus Christ, that thing's grubby. And I said this about Red Robin. I'm so happy I got the experience. I would say I'm not happy I got this experience because it, it there was no experience in it. I, I experienced like nothing. Like I, I literally experienced nothing. Like I don't, there was no example for anything I got because I didn't get to do anything. I, I got to learn how to make potato salad, which which also, like, um, first day I come in and she's like, oh, Renee, you aren't going to be teaching him just so you know. And I'm like, and I didn't say anything, but I was like, and she's like, yes, yes, I know. But she literally taught me so much more than the guy, to be honest, than JR. Like, JR, he taught me, like, how to cook some stuff, right? But she taught me how to make potato salad, how to make the tuna stuff. When, oh, do the onions and stuff like that. And I feel like, I, it was miscommunication, maybe, I don't know exactly, because, like, I was doing stuff. Like, every single time she's like, okay, can you help me? Can you get this for me? I did it. If he did it, if he asked, I would do it. I can't do something if I don't know how to. And those mornings, like, when I was at Red Robin, I couldn't do something if, hey, Paris, can you pack some meat? Yeah, I'll pack some meat. I know how to do it because they taught me. Like, and the other thing was, I was kind of waiting for the moment where, because, like, I was dropping fries for them, and he was, like, maybe getting the pastrami me meat for me if I was like putting the bread on and I was waiting for the moment where I would get to do that by myself right because it's only like like I said there's only one guy and one girl or just like two guys but you know, you know there's only two people one on either side they, they, they sometimes cross over to help my nose is dying <laughs> gotta die they sometimes cross over to help each other, but most of the time, it's just you. And I was waiting for that moment where it's just gonna be me, where I have to put the fries down, I need to go get the pastrami, I need to go get the bread, and I need to do all these things so that I so that I could see if I could do it. And I didn't even get to do that because they were helping me, but also, I, you know, I mean, who knows? Who knows? Is, is it me? Is it me? I mean, I, I mean, on the third day, I literally made, like, another recording where I talked about it, and, but hey, thank God I didn't post that video, because here I am, and it actually happened, but that's my update to you. But you know what's so funny? In the course of three days, I've hit a thousand subscribers. Thank you. Thank you so much. I've been, you aren't do going fast enough. Do you think you could improve the second day? And then on the third day, I get fired. Is <laughs> one negative, two positive? It's two negatives, one positive, at least. I mean, who knows if that number will change? Like, like that guy on Reddit, you realize you make that mistake and you're so determined to do better and to prove that you can do it. And then you try to do it and it just isn't enough and you still get fired. And they're like, you haven't improved at all. Like, like I just, I just don't fully get it. <sighs> at least I got to see Haley, before I got just absolutely just get on. <laughs>